car! Get off my car! Get off my fucking car! Goddamn! Well, well, well. Looks like we back with another video. <laughs> We gonna get straight into this bitch, you know, I ain't about to get in no motherfucking intro, bitch. We just getting straight to it. What are we doing? I don't fucking know, but bitch, we getting to it, though. The fuck? <laughs> we getting to it, bitch. We really getting to it. <laughs> so, bitch, I got a fucking million. Bitch, I got $1.2 million off that racing shit, nigga. Oh, my goodness. I ain't even have to move a motherfucking finger, man. I'm fucking with that. Hey, yo, hold on. Oh, yeah, Michelle. We got to see what Michelle be on. Hold on, nigga. I don't even want your bitch-ass car. Fuck, nigga. Let's see. Them f Damn, they just... Every time, every day outside my house, they just talking. Fake ass hoes. All the niggas be so cap. I'll line you up and take your ass down. 50,000? Hold on, bro. This bitch better be sweet. A nigga can spare 50000 but this shit better be sweet, bitch. Let's see. Bitch, I know you lying. I know you fucking lying, bitch. What the fuck is 50 bands for this? Bitch, I got a crazy-ass crib with a pool table for 40 bands at fucking, in, in fucking Vice City. And you telling me this shit is 50 bands? Maybe I wasn't wrong for talking shit about San Fierro. Because what the fuck is this? Like, literally, what the fuck is this? I'm wasting my motherfucking money, bitch. And then you can barely squeeze through the goddamn save point in, in fucking wardrobe. A nigga trying to leave. A nigga dead ass just trying to leave. Goddamn. This is what it's about, man. Just riding, playing GTA, driving around with some nice ass tunes. Custom tunes at that. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. No, 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 oh man, that's crazy, that's what I get, trying to be sweet, oh. bro, this bitch is never home, god damn, when is this bitch ever home, alright, what the fuck we gonna do in the meantime while we wait for this bitch, cause this bitch never wanna be fucking home, the fuck, I'm just gonna do the derby because I don't feel like doing the motherfucking driving school. Yo, this look nice. I ain't gonna lie. San Fierro look nice. San Fierro look nice. I ain't gonna lie. It's kind of. I don't know. Well, for me, it's kind of slept on. I don't know if everybody else think of the same as like San Fierro and all that, but I'm fucking with this. You know what? It's, this is not, got a nice little uh, vibe to it. Okay. Okay, yeah, here we go. Hold on, let me get a motherfucking hot dog, because I didn't eat at all today. I didn't eat at all. You gotta keep the fat up a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Bro, well, my sex appeal going dumb. Why my sex appeal? Oh, is it the car? Because the nigga flash and shit, they got money. They got the gold, she see the gold and the cube and the, and the chain and the rings and shit. And she think it down. So each one is different. Because last time, we was just doing a, a whole fucking race. This one is like... I mean, this is a race, but this is ain't nothing like this. Bitch, this is motherfucking um that one PS2 game with the clown and shit. Yeah, this is something different. Look at that nigga shooting and shit. Oh yeah, we killing shit, bitch. Hold on. Er, fuck, is you talking about? Okay, watch the fuck out though, bitch. Fuck, is you talking about? Bitch ass niggas. Hold on. Okay, hold on. I'll be taking all the shit though. Don't take all the shit. Watch out. Them niggas clapping my shit. Hold on. Hold on. Bitch, nigga, I don't give a fuck about what y'all talk about. I ain't killing shit. Yo, stop taking all the shit. This is easy. This is easy. Hold on. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, watch out. Watch out. Okay, this one mine. No! Hold on. Hold on, bitch. Watch out. Watch the fuck. Bro, are you serious? Oh, yeah, kill that bitch, nigga. Oh, bro, no, no, okay. Okay, right, right there. I got that one. Are you serious? Oh, my God, bro, hold on. Wait, no! Get the fuck! Oh, okay, let me chill. Oh, these niggas are on my cock! Oh, my fucking God, bitch. Okay. Bro, this car ain't got no fucking handles. 
bitch. Wait, what? How? Do... Hmm, how, bitch? I literally was in there. Hold on, bro. No, run that shit back. I don't give a fuck, nigga. No, I don't care about no motherfucking introduction, bitch. Get to the shit. Get straight to the shit. This fucking car is ass as fuck. Look at this shit. Watch out! Bro! I'm not getting- They not letting me get- I mean, they don't- Supposed to let me get- Bro, are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> they got me that. They're trying to get me. I'm a character, but it ain't happening, bitch. <laughs> yeah, I know what they trying to do. I know what the game trying to do, but they ain't- I ain't letting them do it, though. I'm just gonna win this game, you know, respectfully. Bitch. Wait, how did I not get that? How the fuck did I- I literally rolled past that shit, bitch! Oh, shit, man. Bro, get off my car! Get off my fucking car! Goddamn! Bitch, fuck you talking about? Oh, yeah! Bitch! Fuck, nigga! Go ahead, get it. Strategic around here, nigga. I'm getting this one. Oh, it's over. Now you niggas dying. I got time today, bitch. I got my time up, nigga. You niggas is dying. Get off my fucking cock, bitch. Look at that nigga. Look at that nigga. Niggas killing themselves. Trying to be on my cock. Imagine killing yourself to, to lick cock. That shit don't even make sense. Nigga dodging into... Bitch! Fuck is you talking? Huh? I only destroyed three cars. I can swear not did more than that. Oh well, it don't matter. It might be a little measly ass 10,000, bitch. I'm winning shit, though. I'm winning shit, though. Motherfucking hot dog, bitch. I ain't gonna lie, she the most useful bitch I got. What girl do you know fix a nigga car for free, bro? Hi, girl. Little white on, bitch baby? with you, bitch. She don't wait. She don't even. I'm hungry. Let's go eat now. I don't That's even think she white, low key. I think she uh like one of them white pass and Latinos or something. Like I mean white pass and Latinos. Wait, wait, where the fuck? Wait, what did she like to do? Okay, we can go to we can go downtown to Burger Shop. Okay, please tell me, please tell me this ain't gonna be no bad date, bro. Oh, fuck. Oh, man. Oh, I didn't see, bro. I wasn't. Ah, oh, bro, the. Whoa. What was that it? Like, like. Hold on, baby. Okay, okay. She's still there. I can't, I can't lose her, that bitch. She, she, she be bringing a nigga car up, you know what I'm saying? She fixing a nigga car up. I can't lose that bitch. I gotta come harder than that, bro. Hey, come on, baby. I'm so sorry. Hello, I'm a... girl. How you doing, gorgeous? We gonna do it. Okay, so she didn't like that other shit that burger shit so we gonna try a diner please like a fucking diner bitch please what a trashy place this is. damn she don't like this area what the fuck oh this bitch about to be aggravating already i could fucking tell just being fucking petty for no reason bitch what you want some fucking drinks god damn she already pissing me off Fine, God damn, hold on. She got the best rack out of all the girlfriends. <laughs> Little pixelated titties, okay. <laughs> hey, okay, okay, we can get a kiss. We can get a kiss. You got time for a coffee? Hey, I'm just. You feel me? Like, I don't even gotta. Of course. I wonder what the inside of her crib looking like. Oh, this bitch be booty naked. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Bro, her crib is ass as fuck, but... <sighs> I, oh, they got the character. Look, they got the rims and shit in the back. That's funny. Oh, Hell yeah. Baby. Yo, they didn't... Oh, good, baby. You're incredible. You should get paid for this. <laughs> Tell me I'm the best. That feels so good. <laughs> Crazy. My little San Fierro chick, man. Oh, who is this? Hey, Caesar. The yay leaving San Fierro, right? 
Right, but they're using bikes, DJ, and they go cross country. Mm -hmm. Fucking let's Okay, I'm gonna see what I can dig up. Hey, I'm fucking with my little San Fierro chick, man. She, I ain't gonna lie, she, she for show number two, for show a strong number two. Speaking of girlfriend, she right there. Okay, hold on, let me see. Let me see if I can kill these niggas real quick and get on that date with that little little thing. Oh yeah, come here, bitch. You're dead. You're dead. I don't even know why you're running. Look at the bike you're on. You're dead, bitch. Fuck what you talking about. 1900 I mean that ain't even shit for real cuz a nigga a nigga just having shit already hey hold hey, on what's going on baby I want to get some food inside me you got a strange idea of fun but whatever you say some food where the fuck does she like to go we going to go here oh oh yeah this is they got a different scene for this oh wow <laughs> I'm for sure dealing with a Karen. She for sure got that Karen here because she's not that bad looking compared to the other girls. Everything, she probably got the best looking face out of all the chicks I got. Michelle got the, definitely got the best rack. Come on, gangster, take your mom home. Katie just Asian. Anyway. And Denise? That's amazing. She like overall all around type shit. Hey, how about some coffee? She want coffee. Oh, bro, I'm just, hey. Hey, these hoes do be going. <laughs> if you the right nigga, they do be going though. What the fuck is this about? Yo, every bitch got something different. So this bitch wearing a fucking ammo, a uh, ammo belt on her to some country music. Okay, this bitch different. Come on, girl. Fucking that bitch on a god. <laughs> Baby. Fuck it, that bitch on a oh, goddamn. I never understood the phrase meaningless sex. You're incredible. You should get paid for this. That was on the goddamn farm flow. This is. <laughs> Hell nah, bro. I'm not fucking with this. I will not be back. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, bitch. Bro, we're literally just in the butt fuck of nowhere. Like, what the fuck is this? I, I will never come back here again. Cause I get over here and I and I'm just left with nothing. I'm not. I don't know. I literally can't. I could have sworn I came here with a motherfucking motorcycle. Drop this bitch off and I have nothing. And then there's barely a road close enough to do anything, bro. What type of shit is this, bro? The shit niggas go through for coochie. This is crazy. Niggas need to focus on themselves. I'm about to just focus on myself. I never go this far for coochie. <laughs> you know what's crazy? I've went on a mission before, and then I think like afterwards I just be like, "Why, wow, bro? This this just shit wasn't even worth it." I wish I had just stayed home. <laughs> and it really don't even be nothing wrong with the girl. It just be like, I don't even know. I, anytime I gotta go out on a mission, it just don't even feel right, bro. Just come to my shit, bro. Nine times, out, eight times out of ten, my shit probably better than wherever the fuck I'm about to go. Especially if it's like a real kind of mission. Trucking. Oh shit, I got my CDL, bitch. I got my CDL. Hey, if nothing works, get your motherfucking CDL, bitch. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Hold on. Hold on, bro. Yeah, buddy. I'm back in here, bitch. I'm front of the truck. Goddamn thing. Hell yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. I got my CDL, bitch. I just got my CDL. A nigga ready to truck again. Oh, look at that. Look at that bitch. Look at the bitch, the cowboy. Okay, anyway. Oh, we about to get some trucking going on in this bitch, man. Fuck it. Look at this. Look at my rig, bitch. Oh, shit. Do you see me? <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. I got 60 seconds to reattach the trailer, bitch. Oh my fucking god, bro. Anyway, like I was saying, bitch, it's something new every fucking day. Well, first the beat between J. Cole, Kendrick, and Drake. And then, next thing you know, you look up the fucking feds trying to catch the diddler. <laughs> trying to catch Diddy for, for, for that wild crazy shit he be on, man. And it, it's not surprising. 
like it's, it's, some, it's some shocking shit going on but it ain't surprising it's just very interesting like that nigga be up to all that shit it, it don't make it's just like bitch you got all this money you know like nigga just sit your ass the fuck down how hard is it to just sit niggas get rich and famous and just start doing just silly shit just indulging in the silliest shit like niggas really i mean i get it when you get money you do get kind of bored but at the same time it's like you could do other things bro you ain't gotta play with other niggas asses and shit like that hold on bro let me get this crib because we really in this truck and shit now bitch god damn oh uh, god damn uh, uh. Yep, back at the motherfucking post with this shit. Let's go. Let's go. Let's do this. 15. Oh, okay, so it goes up each time. Okay. But yeah, man, that Diddy shit is crazy. Yeah, niggas think he murdered his ex-wife and shit. And I don't know, bro. There's just so much shit going on, bro. This this world. This world is crazy. Then they said Meek Mill was got his ass took too. <laughs> <laughs> I said that nigga did he pulled a dildo lever on the wall and escaped through a secret tunnel. <laughs> no, I said that nigga pulled a dildo lever on the wall and escaped through a secret tunnel, man. Nigga had the cockmobile waiting in the underground tunnel for him to make his great escape. <laughs> this nigga Meek Mill was waiting on him on that on that jet. Oh yes, let's go. Okay, well, okay, two. Okay, so they counting. Okay, they counting. Okay, let's go. These guys are hiding. Will the truck? Whoa, police! Bro, are you serious? This big ass truck I got. Oh my god, bro. Okay, it's not that bad. I I'm making it through. It ain't that bad. Easy. Third one done. Let's go. I think it's crazy what uh, money and power do to people. Like with all that Diddy shit. And just the people around him, how they just letting all that shit happen, and then they, uh, it's getting to a point where niggas actually indulging in that shit is just some wild ass shit. And I don't understand, like, what do niggas be wanting with fucking, fucking 13, 14 year old kids? Like, bitch, you, and it don't make, it make, don't make even more sense, cause bitch, you got, you got access to bitches your age, cause it's, so it's like, it really don't make no sense. You can get fine ass bitches your age with, with like, you know, niggas really be liking them kids. They really be liking them damn kids. Like, what the fuck is this? 24-7. Oh, a convenience store. Well, that might well gonna get me a shoulder. This is the life of a trucker. Now, look at this bitch ass nigga. Man, this motherfucker dirty nigga. You don't take care of this bitch. Nah, that's just your job, huh? You just work here, though, huh? You say you ain't the janitor, you the cashier. Ha <laughs> ha! I feel you, baby. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy how money and what money and power make niggas do. Money, power, fame, all that shit. How that just affects the the person. But they say, you know, that shit. That shit don't really change you for real per se. It just it just sparks the change in you. Basically, it gives you the power to be the nigga who you always truly was. It gives you the power to live out whatever type of shit you had in your head to begin with, you know? Like me, I would never say I was like ever rich before. I've come across a good amount of money, like a really, really good amount of money for like, especially for like a young age. And um, I tried to be smart with it and I've been pretty smart with it. I've made some silly decisions, I guess, but I guess you could say it's justifiable. And now, like, a nigga actually moved out and shit. Just now moving out, actually. Moved out, like, uh... I don't know, about last year, summer, last summer. Actually, things I've noticed moving out... Well, number one, obviously, the relationships are, like, completely different. Because me and my ex, we actually, uh... We lived with my, uh... With my parents. And everything was pretty cool, so I'm thinking like, oh, okay, everything's cool. We living together for for this amount of time, like about six months or something, a little over six months. So I'm like, okay, we can uh, live together for real. Live together for real. Shit was shit, then goddamn changed. I kind of was more prepared for that shit than she was. I, I'm a pretty, I guess I'm a pretty nonchalant type of person, 
and she she couldn't really stand that shit. She, I think it'd get to the point where she would just do things to try to get a reaction out of me. Like this bitch would sit up here and tell me about how many niggas she can get, how many niggas be messaging her and this and that. And I never gave a fuck about none of that shit to be honest. I'd always tell her ass, I don't give a fuck. If you if you if you like their attention so much or you wanna be with who so and so so much, then you know what you can do. You can I always gave her ass the option to leave. Like literally, whenever she wanted to, the bitch can leave. I'm just not about to tolerate that shit. Like I'll tell her like bitch, I love you, right? I do, I love you. But at the same time, I'm not about to force you to do nothing you don't wanna do. If you really feel like you ain't happy, you know, I'm not about to try to force you to be with me, you know, just go ahead and leave, because I know for sure, if I wasn't happy, I would leave, you know, I mean, I would try to, I would try, I will try to make it work a little bit, because, you know, everybody go through their little ups and downs, there'll be times where I literally don't even like, I don't even like my girls, there'll be times I don't like my girl, you know, I don't even, you know, you kind of disgust me, but, you know, I love you. Cause it don't it don't always be about the feeling or really even the love sometimes. It just be about the commitment. You gonna go through them phases where you just you know. So that's how I always be thinking about it. The most I make a girl do that she don't wanna do is when we come into a compromise, you know, like I'ma do some things that I don't wanna do because I know that's some things I'm willing to sacrifice for the betterment of our relationship. You know, as long as it's not making me too unsatisfied. I'm getting as long as the result is uh like I'm getting that short term dissatisfaction for the long term satisfaction, you know what I'm saying? So I kind of weigh it like that, Sh short term unhappiness for long term happiness. Please, please, please. Shit! This could go so bad, okay. No, y'all. It's over. Oh my fucking god, bro. Are you serious? Ha! Uh, I'm just about to go back home. I definitely want to finish that truck and shit, though. Okay, first and foremost, before we even fucking go home, bitch, we gotta make this bitch home. You feel me, baby? Oh yeah, let's get it on now, baby. Easy. Look at that. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so we got our trucking on. We fucking fucked with Michelle and Katie and we really we kinda just bullshitted. We didn't bullshit, but we did something at the same time, if that makes sense. Like we did some trucking shit. Nigga got his CDL. I'm I'm a I'm a I'm a for sure a trucker nigga. But not for long, you know. We just tried it out. I ain't fucking with that truck and shit. Fuck that shit. I think it's only been... I don't know how long it's been since I reached 100 subscribers. I think it's only been like about a... About a week for real. We already like 70 plus subscribers up. And... Man, I tell you guys, this shit... I just don't know, you know. I'm staying consistent. I am staying consistent. You niggas keeping me... Keeping me consistent for real. I mean, we uh, hopefully we reach 200 subscribers by I don't know the end of this week. I mean, I don't know. You never know. 500. I just hope we get 500 by the end of this year, and then maybe a thousand next year if I'm there that long. And uh, once we reach a thousand, I don't know. I have no idea what the fuck the what the fucking direction of this challenge is gonna be by the time that happens. Cause who knows how long that sh how long how long away that shit is. Uh, but I do plan on doing like uh, some Skyrim gameplay. Uh, maybe sometime down the line I'll do some GTA 5 RP gameplay. Because it do look kind of interesting now that I got a PC. I mean it's been looking interesting but you know now that I actually got a PC. And can run some mods on my shit. Uh, I think I do want to dive into that GTA 5 RP shit. I'm not sure if I want to do multiplayer or like kind of do my own little thing in like a little singular server if that's even 
a thing. But uh, yeah, I'm definitely uh fucking with that. I gotta uh, get into that. I'm not sure which one's gonna come first. Probably more likely I'll end up doing the Skyrim shit. And I'll probably do like I I, I kind of want to do some like Brawlhalla clips and shit in the, in between as well. Cause I I fuck with Brawlhalla. I, I actually be having fun with that shit. Now I'm not sure if that's something y'all be fucking with or I, I guess I really don't have no audience for real. So I guess the channel is whatever the fuck I make it. I don't know what the niche is for that or how big the pool is for that. It really I guess I'm just gonna see how it works out because it's fun and we just gonna go from there. But in the meantime I'm rambling and talking too long so um. You niggas eat a cock or something. I'll see you niggas another time, probably Monday, because this will be dropping Friday. And uh, yeah, y'all take care.